Oh shit. Oh shit. We got a dragon. Okay. Okay. We got ourselves a dragon, guys. We got ourselves a dragon. Frost dragon. Frost dragons seem to be a whole lot um, better. Alright, it's coming back. Ah! Come on! What a way to start the episode, guys. Alright, pause. Fire breath. Alright, if we can if we can get in there with our uh, ebony sword. Oh yeah, there we go, we killed it. Oh I love the like jumping on his head and like Alright, I didn't expect that to happen. Welcome to the video guys! Alright, I don't think we're actually gonna be able to uh, take the dragon bones. I don't think we're actually gonna be able to do that. So I was just out off camera trying to harvest, um... <laughs> and the sucking noise. <laughs> Indigo's so funny. I don't think we're actually going to be able... We got two more dungeons to do, so I'm not gonna use that soul yet. I don't actually think we're gonna be able to, uh, carry the dragon bones. Um, let's, is there a traitor in Iverstead? I don't remember. Someone who will at least buy our dragon bones, maybe. Alright, I was out looking for mountain flowers because, and there's none around here, um... I was out looking for mountain flowers because we're out of drink, completely. So, it might be worth it to... Honestly, as much as I hate fast traveling, it might be worth it to fast travel to Iverstead. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead, let's, um, we're gonna pack up camp. Um. Crap, okay. Uh, pack up. Pack up the tent. Are we, we actually have a level up available. All right, Inigo. Can you whistle? Yes, I can whistle, Inigo. Um, well, it could be a good I need to trade some things with you. Look, I found uh, it made interesting reading. Oh, great! Another thing added to my inventory. Anyway, what did you want to talk about? Take my crap. <laughs> uh, I need to give you my crap so that we can. Um... Yeah. Okay. Uh, by weight. Alright, uh, what are you actually able to take? Anything will help. And then I think we're just gonna eat a crap ton of our heaviest food. Yeah, you're not able to take freaking anything. Okay, Inigo is full. All set? Lydia! Mind you. How can I serve you, my thane? You can carry my burdens. Like the pack mule you are. This has a weight of nine. Ugh. Uh, um. Okay, well, we're kind of using the Imperial Bow right now. Uh. Take that armor. Uh, take all that dead wood. Uh, ooh, I could give you my pelts. I don't really have many pelts. I should have a frick ton of pelts, and I don't know where they are. Uh, 
Okay, so a lot of the uh, pelts. Okay, so you can't you can't hold the the the, the, the pelts. Crap! All right. All right, so what's the new heaviest thing I can give you? Uh, a crap ton of seared fat. Which is basically not helpful. Okay. So in that case, can I move yet? Yes, I can. Okay. So we packed up. As much as I hate to fast travel, we're going to. Uh, just because I have to sell stuff. And I need water. Uh, I'm not going to actually be able to make it there without water. I'm going to fucking die of thirst. So. And I don't want to do that. So let's go ahead and fast travel to. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. You okay? Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Which Jarl? Looks like that's it. Got I believe this is the one from Falkreath. So, uh. Forming the dawn boy. Vampire hunters or something in the old. Okay, that's a house. I don't think that there is a actual proper trader here, which is bad. Uh, bad, something... So nope. Alright, so, uh, let's see what we can do in the inn, and then... I want to stay in this area. I don't want to fast travel past this area. Uh, okay. Refill the water, please. It's a lot of water. So, and I'm carrying too much to be able to run. Frick. Uh, what have you got for sale? Please. For the thirsty, food for the hungry. Please tell me that you'll sell more than, or that you'll buy more than. Ah, uh, you'll only buy my food. Frick. Uh, I do not have enough. Alright, as much as I don't want to do this, we now have the water. Again, stop by for a drink. Ah, crap. Um, I don't think I can fast travel right now, can I? So we're going to have to, like, eat until we can. Crap, okay. Uh, let me try it. We're gonna try and fast travel to... Yeah, no, we can't fast travel. Okay, so let's eat uh, as much as we can. Uh, sort by weight. <sighs> Aid stamina recovery, though. Ugh. There we go. Alright, we're gonna fast travel to Riverwood because I have no other choice, and then we'll fast travel to the dungeon. I don't want to do this. I really don't want to do this, but I have no choice. I have to sell stuff. I have to. Um... I, I have to sell stuff. That's the problem. Um... So, yeah. Thank you and me. We're the Oh, a bit of this and a bit All right, of that. we need to sell all of our all of our stuff. Uh I Okay, no, that's his stuff. Actually, I am going to buy that bear pelt off you. Because, uh, I'm just struggling so much. Okay. Alright. Uh, I'll keep that. I have to keep those. I'll keep that. Um. 
I think from there... We're good. Actually, we can go to... Ah, uh, crap. I really need to... I really need to sell stuff off so that I... Stupid kid. Alright, let's go talk to this guy over here, see what he's got for sale. We can get rid of our weapons. That we don't need. You looking for... Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Okay. So... You can take my armor and stuff off my hands. Okay, you can take that hunting bow and... Th that hunting bow, because we'll actually do, do up this imperial bow. Uh, iron daggers. Iron greatsword you can take. Steel sword you can take. Because I've got my ebony swords. Uh, right! We were gonna disenchant this. Uh, the next time we get a chance. You can take that iron armor. Imperial light boots. What am I wearing? Uh, I have scaled boots, which are 13 armor versus hide boots, which are... So oh, yeah, you can have those. And I have fur bracers, which are 8 armor versus these, which are 7. Yeah, you can have that as well. Good day. I should be able to move around now. Okay. So, Inigo, his inventory is empty. Uh, well, pretty empty. Lydia is not. Um, do you have any armor or anything on you? Um, what, what do you got in the way of armor? Okay, you have an imperial sword, uh, a steel sword, and a silver sword. Uh, and you're using the axe of white run right now. And you have a hunting bow. You have no arrows. Let me... Let me give you those so that you have some arrows. Uh, but I will take that Imperial Sword, Silver Sword, and Steel Sword since you've got the Axe of White Run. Uh, armor. You're not using any of it! Alright, I can take that, sell it. Yeah, see, this is a problem whenever you don't use the stuff I give you. I need, like, a companion mod on or something. Okay. Ironers, take a look. Okay. So... Imperial Sword, I don't need that. Honestly, I'm going to get rid of this other iron dagger. Silver sword, steel sword, I don't need those. Uh, and studded imperial armor, I don't need. It. Okay. Until next time. So that should be enough for us to go into the um, barrows. Um, what quest is enabled right now? The Dawn Guard. Oh, I really don't care. Alright, um... Alright, so... We're not gonna be able to finish it if we go. Let's fast travel back over to here so that we still have to walk most of the way to where we're going. Better be good. What do you got on him? Uh, damage stamina, uh, a whole bunch of gold. 
Horsehide, Ice Wolf Pelt. Ah, uh, an Orcish Bow, which does 10 damage. Uh, Saber Cat Pelt. What does my bow do? 9 damage. Okay. I'll take that bow, but I'm also going to give you my bow and favorite this bow. Okay, there we go. What do you want? This, I believe, is actually an orc camp. Can I talk to you? Forgive Ugar's harsh words. She's merely doing as she's been told. What's going on here? Our tribe. Yeah, this is an orc stronghold. We need help. Our chief Yamars was once a strong and proud warrior. Now he is stricken. Cursed. Cursed? He is weak. And so our tribe is weak. The giants sense this and intrude on our territory. Now they assault our very home. Yamars refuses help. But I sense that you may be just what we need. Indeed. What can I do? Yamars has demanded we stay inside the walls. We cannot leave. I must petition Malakath for relief. This curse must be lifted. But I cannot travel to Malakath's shrine. The ritual must be done here, and I do not have the materials I need. So you need me to go I get you the materials you, you need. Bring me troll fat and a daedra heart. I have no wish to depend on a stranger, but I have no choice. Uh, well, yes, I can. Where can I find a daedra heart? In a daedra, of course. Well, duh. Please hurry. We okay. Let's... On you. Let's head on then. Uh, and... If we see any of that stuff, we will make sure to grab it. Uh, in the meantime, I believe... Let's make for that, um... Angarvundi. Let's make for that. Should be off this way. Oh boy. Yeah, there it is. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and head over there and um, begin our delving. Or, well, actually, we'll probably just get there and that'll be the end of the episode. This episode's a little bit boring and I, I definitely do apologize for that. It's just... Um, Sometimes you've got to do things. I one hit freaking wolves and it's awesome. Uh, alright, we kind of have to go around a little bit. I think. I don't think it's up there, I think it's kind of down a little bit if I remember correctly. Because I was able to put it on the map pretty easy. Yeah, it's like right here. Okay, it's just a fox that I hear. Okay. So this is it. I'm uncertain where the entrance is, I believe. Yeah, that's the entrance right there. Okay. So, uh... Please tell me we can make... nope. I need more f mountain flowers so that I can make more tea. Is that one of the old ruins? Uh... Interesting. Okay, this is pretty short. Whispers of this ancient temple have been few and far between and most... Real knowledge seems to be similar to uh, 
An Angarvandi itself, buried and forgotten. Yet every story or legend I hear all seem to speak immeasurable riches found deep within. Great treasure awaits for the worthy adventurer, said one old fool after many false flirtations and tankards of mead. Though he may have been a nuisance, his information matches most of my research, specifically in the location of um, Angerf Angervond. Uh, tomorrow I will hire a mining team to assist me in my ex excavation and head towards the ruin. Um, by this time next month I shall be rich. Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay. So, that is going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit the like button down below if you're new to the channel. Please consider subscribing, and we will see you in the next video. Later!